Hello everyone, my name is Peter. I am from thesupportzone.com and the purpose of thesupportzone.com is to offer bookkeeping services to small businesses. So with the help of today's video, we are going to see common problem where, general, uh, where user generally face. Like when they try to open QuickBooks desktop on their computer, sometimes QuickBooks is unable to pull up. It is unable to open up. If it does open, it suddenly closes out. If I say suddenly turn off on a computer when they are trying to open it up. So with the help of today's troubleshooting steps, we are going to fix this problem. And with the help of all these steps, one of the steps will going to work for you in this case. And if it does not, you can contact me. You can comment below on this video here. If I say. so, let's say I am uh, like you can see here. I am quick. I'm using QuickBooks Pro Plus 2024. And let's assume. When I'm trying to make a double click on it, it is not pulling it up. It is not opening up. So what is the first step that you need to take? You need go ahead and press Control, Shift and Escape, T, Escape key to open the task manager. Okay. When you open the task manager, you need to go to details. Okay. And then choose any of the services here and then click on Q. And you will be able to see all these options. Or you can say all these services are running. You need to turn them off one by one. Okay, just make a right click on them and then click on end task and then click on end press. Do the same all services which are running into your computer if I say. And then once all the services are completely out of this you can say list you can close this window and then try to open quick okay if the same problem still exists we need to go to the second step is to go ahead and repair the quick book. and in order to repair the quick book you need to open the control panel on your computer and then click on programs and futures okay if you cannot see this option like this as it is showing on my computer you can click on this here view by and click on this drop down menu and choose large icons and once you click on large icons you can click on programs and futures okay once you click on programs and futures then in the list of programs you need to look up for your quickbooks version in my case i'm using quickbooks pro 2024 you just need to click on that and then you need to click on uninstall and change will ask you to allow the permission click on yes and then click on next and then click on like choose repair and then click on next again and then click on repair on this window okay so the repairation process will be started which will going to take like uh, a couple of minutes depending on your computer performance if your computer is fast it will going to do all the things quickly so we need to wait for this one to get this repairation process completed all right so in in between this repairation process this window may comes uh, comes up on your computer you just need to click on okay here okay and then you need to wait for this like uh, window to completely or uh, if i say we need, we just need to wait for this process to complete all right so if it does show you any kind of a error mess in between the repairation process no need to worry nothing to worry about it Okay, as I am a bookkeeper, I have already dealt with these kind of problems with my existing clients. You can contact anytime regarding this and I would be happy to help you in this situation. As well. You may also see this option here. You just need to click on OK and then we're going to go ahead to peer the QuickBooks on your computer. All right, here you can see a green bar is starts to move forward. Uh, again here see here right as I said it will gonna take a minute we just need to wait to get this for uh, like to get this completed so let's see here and then we will move forward from there right okay uh, so it is taking some time now okay so what I will do once this repairation process will be completed I will be back to you okay it will not going to show you any kind of uh, kind of uh, error message generally but in case comes up or show you with some kind of a notification as I said, no need to worry comment below and I will try to reply you in case you won't get a reply for your comment you can contact me anytime the contact information is mentioned in the below description box you can email me you can leave an inquiry on the website or you can also like call me on the provided phone number okay and here see I believe it is gonna complete so I would not to take any kind of a break to get this thing completed here so let's see here 
All right, so you can see here, like the repairation process has been completed. You can just click on finish and then asks you to restart your computer. My suggestion would be, please go ahead and restart your computer. I am not going to do that because in order to continue this video, but my suggestion is to copy the video link somewhere and save it or bookmark this video and then try to restart your computer and then continue with the video in order to get the problem fixed on your computer for your quick path. So I'm just clicking on no here and then let's say you after completion of the repairation process you need to go ahead and open your quick books again. If quick books is going to get open it's good but if it does not no need to worry, there is another tool which we need to use in this case in order to get the problem fixed and the tool name is Tool Hub. In the previous videos, I have created a complete video about how to download and install QuickBooks Tool Hub and all that here. The video is also mentioned in the description, you can see it to see how you can download the QuickBooks Tool Hub. In my computer, I believe QuickBooks Tool Hub is also downloaded. Uh, no, it is not, but uh, there is a downloadable file is available. So I'm just going to click on that in order to install it on the computer. Okay, if you would like to see how you can download QuickBooks Tool Hub, the video link is also mentioned in the below of a description. Please go ahead and check it out and you will be able to see it. It is just a small video and you can do it not to worry about it. Okay, so if you can see there is one more icon comes up here on the computer desktop screen that known as QuickBooks Tool Hub. So what you need to do, you are unable to open the QuickBooks after repairation of your QuickBooks desktop. You need to go here where it says program problems. Then click on fix my program. Quick fix my program what generally do, it will going to stop all kind of services which generally runs on the back end and then try to run it on this side. So this notification comes up, you just need to click on OK. And after doing this, close QuickBooks Tool Hub and then try to open QuickBooks again on your computer. If the same problem still exists, no need to worry. There is a second program known as Books Program Diagnostic Tool. You can click on it, run this program. It will going to take a while to complete. If you can see, it says 5% complete. Until it completes to 100%, it will going to do all kind of processes on the back end. If you can see, it says 20% now. 25% so it will going to work on the back end but you will be able to see this window on your screen so no need to worry about this let it be going here like this and once it is completed then we will gonna move forward to the next step okay. so this thing is going on I will do one thing here once this process is completed I will be back to you guys okay all right guys as you can see installation deck tool also ran here and if you can see it says 100% complete so now we can click on ok alright so now once this thing is done close QuickBooks tool hub try to run QuickBooks desk on your computer it will work normally if I say proper way let's say to doing all these we just did you still have problem where QuickBooks is unable to open. Nothing to worry. The last we can take to uninstall or reinstall Tool Hub. Uninstall and reinstall QuickBooks Tool Hub won't make any impact on your company file. Okay, we'll simply uninstall the program and reinstall it. But there are three things you need to keep in mind before you uninstall and reinstall QuickBooks on your computer. If I say before uninstall installing the QuickBooks, you need to have your QuickBooks license and the product number handy. Okay, you can find out the license and the product number for your QuickBooks. And let's say you are unable to open the QuickBooks, so you cannot find the information into it. But what you can do, you can go to a website camps.intuit.com. So once you will go here, you need to log into your Intuit account. So with the help of your Intuit account, you will be able to get your license and the product information. Okay. Second thing, as you cannot open QuickBooks on your computer, you need a copy of your company file somewhere safely or like a backup, like a recent backup, like a, a week old backup or a couple of days ago backup or something like that. You need to save that copy of your backup somewhere on your computer. And the last thing that you need to keep in mind that uh, like uh, QuickBooks, when you run the QuickBooks, please ensure about this thing. There is no antivirus is kind of running on the background. When I say antivirus, please try to 
avoid any antivirus is running when you try to reinstall the test because sometimes antivirus cause the problems while reinstalling the QuickBooks on the computer okay but if you would like to see the video how you can completely uninstall and reinstall QuickBooks the video link is also mentioned below in the description you can go ahead and check it out with the help of that you can complete uninstall and reinstall QuickBooks on your computer after taking all these steps let's say you still have the same problem as I said no need to worry you can contact QuickBooks support team. They can help you easily. In case you really want to get some kind of an assistance from my side, you can also contact me. You can also put your comment in the comments uh, section below. I will try my best to respond them. Okay. Otherwise, you can contact me on my website here. This is my website. This is my contact number. You can also contact me on this number. And this is my email address. You can also drop me an email on this email. And I will be there who will answer your inquiry as soon as possible. Okay. So with the help of today's video, easily fix the problem when QuickBooks won't open on your computer. If you have any doubts, any questions, you can like as I mentioned, you can comment me below and I will be there to respond. All right. So I will see you in the next video. Till then, have a good one. Bye-bye.